Hello and welcome to Reality News Roundup. Here are the top stories of the day. Industrious Kumar Mangam Billa, chairman of the Aditya Billa Group, has forayed into the Mumbai commercial property market by carving out the real estate business of Century Textiles. Billa Estate plans to redevelop its properties in and around Mumbai. The new entity has already spent around rupees 2,500 crore in building various properties, including a skyscraper called Billa Aurora in Prabha Devi. Union Urban Development Minister M. Vaikanya Naidu on Thursday asserted that the urban infrastructure sector has offered Rs 73 lakh crore investment opportunity for private sector and PPP investments over the next 15 years. He was speaking at a function in New Delhi on Thursday. Global investment firm KKR has picked up a stake of about 5% in two luxury residential projects being developed by Mumbai-based Suntech Realty in Bandra Kulla Business District for Rs 150 crore. The projects are expected to be ready in a year and a half. The Delhi government's pollution watchdog Delhi Pollution Control Committee has imposed a fine of Rs 50,000 per day to 13 mega construction projects of DDA, Airport Authority and DLF for spreading dust pollution in the national capital. According to the Pollution Watchdog, the developers would have to deposit a fine of Rs 50,000 per day since January 20th. The notices have been issued to stop work following the directions of the National Green Tribunal orders pertaining to air pollution of drift from construction and demolition activity. The government will launch a new policy this month to ensure early clearance of urban infrastructure and housing projects as part of its initiative to improve ease of doing business in the country. This was stated by Urban Development Minister Venkaya Naidu at India Investment Summit. He said the government was keen on ease of doing business and was working on a scheme to facilitate quick approval of urban infra and housing projects for which he had consultations with six ministries including defense, civil aviation and environment. Thank you for watching. For latest updates, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and Instagram.